Hello everybody and welcome back to another The Leftovers episode. Don't mind my hair, it's too hot today. We're just gonna get right to the episode. This is season one, episode five, Gladys. And remember that this reaction is going to be full on my Patreon page. If you're interested, the link is gonna be in the description box. Fuck you, you fucking cunt. <laughs> I mean, they're weird. Seriously, they're not helping? Fuck them, fucking cunts. All they do is fucking smoke all day. How do they know they still have a voice? You know what I'm saying? You can't scream, honey. You're being kidnapped. I think you're allowed to scream here. Oh, shit. Okay, that's fucked up. They're killing her for real. That's fucked up. They're cunts, but... Jesus. They don't deserve to die. Not like that. Do they shower? Where's everyone going? That's gonna be fucked up. When they find her. That was a lot of blood. They can't go to the police, right? Because even the police hates them. At least the chief does. So he's real? I thought he wasn't. I thought the chief made him. Like in his head. I mean, what they did in the previous episode, it's, it's, it, it was fucked up. Just breaking into people's houses and stealing all the pictures. They weren't killing anyone or anything, but not cool. Honey, do laundry. You have time to keep those abs. You have time to do laundry. Oh, stop. The fuck is she do Like, does she leave there? What is happening? What a bitch. I don't, like, stop. I don't want her hooking up with him. I don't. She's a kid. Or trying to. I hope he doesn't fall for that. I really hope so. Damn, you're a policeman. You can't fuck an underage girl. Don't. I like you up until now. Don't do it. I guess I should be scared, but I'm not. Because you're not wearing white yet. So they're not going to recognize you. Well, they're in danger now. They're like being targeted and killed. Uh, chief, so one of the witnesses says he's gonna. He's fucking real. Be hey, careful, goddammit! <laughs> fucking horrific. Right? She was a human being. Can they not be assholes? At least, not now that she's dead. She fucked her crush. I can't get over it. I don't. I can't. Jill. Honey. Jill, what's wrong? <laughs> Jill? What the Jill? hell? Wait. You and Amy order a pizza. I'm gonna work late. She she lives with them. I'll see you till the morning, okay? She's always there, but I thought she was just visiting. She lives there. Maybe she lost her whole family in the blipping thing. In the dino snap. Hmm. I'm sorry if you already told me that they live together or something in the previous episode, remember that this is pre-recorded. May I ask how many cigarettes a day you're smoking? Mm -hmm. Like 200. I can't believe how she doesn't give a shit about her kids. Tommy is fucking missing. He's not picking up his phone because it was broken. 
What if it was Eccles and the one who did that because these guys bought the church? Well, uh, Eccles and, and friends. <laughs> I love him. Please give Agent Kalani's contact information to your boss so that he can undo your fuck up. Oh, uh, he doesn't deserve all this bullshit. <laughs> so they do shower, bathe. Not same thing. But at least, you know, clean my body. Drinking in the job. He earns more points as the show goes on. <laughs> Investigate too hard. He was one of the killers, definitely. She seriously needs to stop being such a bitch. And the friend too. Okay. She fucked her crush, now she mm. wants to fuck her dad, like, stop. Like, now you're Glad the brother's not here because she would fuck him too. Regular clothes? You look nice. They're talking too. Just for the day, say anything you want to. Curse. Wait, I'm doing too. What? <laughs> Out loud. This is fucking good. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'll turn up once you stop looking for me. So? It's Amy. She's stealing her sh his shirts <laughs> to wear them as a as a after sex kind of thing and stare at her reflection in the mirror and be like, oh, my God, like, are they? <laughs> Did that sound like a telenovela? Because it, it does, but you know, could be that. She's a dean. We don't trust those. I really, truly need this character to say fantastic. You can make exceptions if you have to get to a job. So we have to change our lives because of them? Yeah. Girl, someone died very tragically. All in favor of imposing an emergency town-wide curfew to start at 8 p.m. effective this evening. I agree to that. How come no Thank you for your time. How come nobody's taking him seriously? He's trying to fucking help. She's not your wife anymore. No, I haven't signed any papers. She is my wife. I don't want them to get killed like that. Well, we are but if they mm -hmm. don't stop being oh, bitches. Could I have a doggy bag, please? Can I be excused? Please. What? She gonna puke? Killing these people is pointless. Killing is pointless. Period. Mail order us to send her out to Virginia. Oh, the uh, bodies. From oh, Agent Colleen says, if you don't call me back within the hour, I will be in he my needs to chill. or I will fuck. Air from my lungs. I say fuck too. <laughs> She was in the accident. I pick her up myself. He's not gonna let that happen because his wife. Uh, um, He's not gonna do it. Uh, but no thanks. Oh my God! Are you okay? Oh no, babe. This is such a bad idea. More white chest. That's, that's not, they're not his. He's taking whatever, that's not. Hello. My name is Matt James. I didn't know your friend very well. I he will not let your foot slip. He who watches punch him? will not slumber. Indeed. She's walking very aggressively. He's just trying to help. Oh, oh, bitches. I love you, honey. Hug him. 
Please. Oh my god, don't. I'll hug him. And just like that. I just, I don't. I don't stand almost any of the characters. Up until now, Chief and Eglison are my babes. Up until now, hate everyone else. Not hate, hate, yes, fucking hate. Can't believe that little bitch didn't hug her dad. I mean, she is hurting, I know, I get it. He is too. Especially with a kid missing and this one that doesn't give a shit about anything. He doesn't deserve all this shit that's happening to him. And mosquitoes today are just eating me alive. Anyways, thank you for watching this episode with me and as always I'm Saramiana and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man if you never wanna grow. Take my hand, I'll take you to Neverland. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man.